G'day guys, I'm thrilled to introduce a brand new sponsor to our show and it is Outback Armour. Now, both of my sons, Bill and Angus, have been running this suspension for the last 12 months or so and I was pretty damn impressed with how it went. And as a result, I thought, let's put it under our brand new Ford Ranger and Ford Everest. And I've got to say that even though I've only driven these cars around for a few hundred K so far, I am mightily impressed. One of the things I really liked about Outback Armour is the fact that it is all engineered and designed in Australia, actually out of Geebung in Brisbane. But the other nice thing I liked about the brand is the fact that they do really push the limits, particularly for independent suspension four-wheel drives. We've got about 50 mil lift in our Everest, about 40 mil lift in the Ranger, and that allows us to put some good sized tires on. It's not silly lift, it's still very smart, but allows us to put 33 inch rubber underneath both of those vehicles and it completely transforms the way they travel off road. Now, they do it all particularly high quality. I mean, it's really all, this is a premium suspension kit here. So, you know, whenever you lift a four wheel drive, it does change things like your drive line angles. So they put in a center bearing spacer kit just to make sure you don't get any noise or vibrations out of that setup. But one of the other little trinkets that I really am a fan of, and that is the adjustability in this heavy duty expedition kit that I've installed on my vehicle. So you've got 20 forms of adjustability as you dial this little guy around. And what that basically means is if you are going into really harsh off-road conditions, lots of articulation, well, you want more control. So you will firm things up a little bit because keep in mind, this is a shock absorber that controls the spring. So you're actually after firmer shocks when you're in those challenging conditions. But then you get back onto the highway, you just want a nice, comfortable, supple ride. That is when you dial it further around to the right and it will soften off nicely for you. So just a couple of the little features that really sold me on this Outback Armour. The true test will be shooting this season of Pat Callanan's 4x4 Adventures and that's when we will put it absolutely through the ringer as we bounce up and down the dunes of South Australia and head up to Fraser Island. So really looking forward to that. But I've got to say, my first taste of Outback Armour suspension on my vehicles has been pretty damn cool. <laughs>